You want to know what's interesting about human beings? Human beings have a bad habit of talking about things they know nothing of, about promising things they have no intentions of fulfilling, and about saying things without considering the ramifications of what was said. Why do we do these things? A lot of times people talk simply because they're emotional. All right. I always say in these videos, we have to become more aware of ourselves because the less aware we are of ourselves, the more we're going to hurt those around us. When we continue to hurt the people around us, we're going to have a downgrade in our relationships. We're going to have less fulfilling friendships. We're going to be distant from our family. Life is just going to suck. We have to become more adaptive to the times. We have to accept the reality for what it is. And what the reality is, is that not everybody is your friend. Not everybody that talks to you has your best interest in mind. Not everybody that talks to you is telling you the truth. They will tell you things, they will promise you things, and they will say things that sounds like these are good people. But if you give it enough time, you will actually find out that the majority of people who say good things don't have good motives and it's a problem because a lot of people in this country take things at face value now unless you've had a recent encounter with some heartache some backstabbing or some betrayal you wouldn't understand what I'm talking about but listen to my advice be careful about what people come to you and say to you whether it be good or bad a lot of times we entertain the opinions of other people but we do so wrongly and that actually corrupts our vision, that actually corrupts our goal, that actually corrupts a lot of our, our things that we have in store for our own life, for our own betterment. See, the fact of the matter is we live in a society and in a world where nobody has high moral character anymore. Nobody has high standards anymore. And so a lot of people are talking a good game. They're fluffing themselves up. They're fluffing their motives up. They're fluffing their ideas up, but nobody is truly willing to follow through. Nobody is truly willing to commit. And so if we take what this person is saying at face value, it can actually upset us. It can actually make us more angry because we didn't expect that person to hurt us in that particular way. But see, it's actually our own ignorance. It's our own disability that actually caused us to get hurt in the first place. So watch out for the promises. Those are the individuals that promise they're going to do something. I promise I'm going to pay you back. I promise I'm going to give you that thing back that you gave me. I promise I'm going to do this for you. I promise I'm going to be there on time. People who promise usually have a bad track record of not fulfilling promises. And the funny thing is, they make more promises to try and compensate for the promises they didn't make. Watch out for those people. Be careful about the flammers. Flammers actually have no intention of doing what they say they were going to do. Now, people who promise they have intentions of at least trying to do what they promise they're going to do, but they don't fulfill it simply because they're not being real with themselves. Flammers are lying from the start. Flammers have no intentions about, you know, protecting this relationship. Flammers have no care whatsoever about what happens to you or what happens to something else. All they want to do is talk to get their way. They are very selfish, very, very deceiving, and they almost say everything you want to hear. Be very careful of those people. So remember guys, knowledge is power. Now that you have this knowledge, it's your duty to go like it and share it and spread it to other people so that they can get this too. Alright? As always, thank you all for the support, man.